Hello, it's Winiko, and today we have such exciting news because Resident Services is finally going to finish its expansion, which means we'll have so many cool new activities to do now. I can't wait. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait for it to load. <gasps> She's a donut. <laughs> she has a donut. Wait, I want to see her munch on it. Yeah, it's so cute. Wow. Oh, she's hiding. That's okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's so pretty. <laughs> this is Tom Nook. It's 9.54 on March 29th. Now that I'm sure you can all guess what I'm going to tell you next, it's a today's big announcement. As stated in the previous broadcast, today we've completed construction of the Resident Services building. That's not uh, that's not all the big news for today. We've also added someone to our island staff. <gasps> Come on over. <laughs> Is it gonna be Isabel? <gasps> she looks so cute. Hello, I'm Isabel. As Mr. Tomnook said, I'm part of Resident Services staff here in Granabana. Oh my god. Well, I still have much to learn. I will do my best to support everyone who calls this island home. Welcome home, Isabel. <laughs> Isabel has previously done resident support work, so I'm sure she'll be a big help to everyone here. That's so true. Oh my god, she's perfect. <laughs> I've got more to share. Oh, the building isn't the only new thing around here. We gave the plaza some much needed improvements as well. Yeah, it looks great. Normally the plaza is for residents and visiting ped peddlers who take advantage of its prime location. But keep an eye out for an occasional seasonal event too. Should be such fun for everyone. Yes, yes. Well, I believe that wraps up my announcements for today. Oops, except for one final one. This is my very last broadcast. Why? Starting tomorrow, Isabel will be your new source. Oh, okay, for island news. Okay, so we still get some. Cute. I'll do my best to share all the latest updates with you, so I hope you'll tune in often. Yeah, of course. Aww. Yes, yes, there you have it. New building, new island staff. We are growing, growing, growing. Finding out what's new at resident finding out what's new at resident services is as easy as stopping by and inquiring, hmm? Of course we plan on holding a ceremony to commemorate the new resident services building. Yay! We'd love to uh sorry, we'd love for everyone to take part. I believe that sums it all up. Isabel and I will be here to help you whenever you need us. Oh great! Oh I'm so excited. <laughs> so yesterday is a little wait, the music is different. Oh? <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Is this the hourly music? Is it did we finally get it? Yesterday a lot happened and sadly I don't have anything to show for it. I mean I can show you as we explore Guanabana today, but like I don't have the actual day. <laughs> Um, but for example, well, I guess the day that resident services announced that they were going under construction I actually decided to expand my home so that we had something new to look at So here my house is expanded. It's a little bigger and the room is just a little bit bigger Nothing really that dramatic, but I just wanted to show you anyway Actually a lot of little things happened around the island, which I'll definitely show you as we explore I think I just said that but yeah, so I'll do that and I really apologize again for losing March 28th I guess it was kind of a waiting day though so it wasn't too, it wasn't like as bad as losing today. Oh my gosh, if I lose today, I'm going to be so sad because we finally got introduced to Isabel. But yeah, I just, <laughs> sorry about that. But I'm really excited to show you everything and play today because I feel like today is going to be really, really fun. So I'm so excited. Okay, let me actually check the mail. <laughs> um, Happy Home Academy. Wow, rank A, congratulations. This time your home scored 10,000 points or more and we're sending you along a commemorative gift. Oh, also they sent me this really cute little pink washer yesterday for expanding my house. And I think it would be really cute in my little laundry when I get that. But we also got a present from them today so we can check that out after. And Nook Inc. Ah, uh, up. Okay, update from, uh, sorry, update from Resident Services. To celebrate the opening of the new Resident Services building, we have lots of new mile redemption items available. Plus, we now have a new service for Nook Miles Plus members to earn five times more miles. A commemorative gift is attached. Ooh, okay, let's look at both of those gifts. I'm excited. Hey, look! Also, we have Rex. What is he doing? He's smelling the flowers. Yeah. Wait, did he have a little tune? 
Yay, are you out for a walk? Let's check. Wait, so much just happened right now. Rex had a tune. The town hall had a tune. What's the... Ah, yeah. We do have hourly music. It changed. Ooh, I like this one. I think. <laughs> I love, sorry, I love long walks. They keep your feet entertained. Wait, <laughs> I like it. Oh, also, Mabel visited us yesterday too, and she's back today, so I'm really excited to see if she has anything special to say. Oh, hey, Nicole. You came just at the right time. There's something I'd like to ask you today. Perfect. Could I bend your ear for a bit? Sure, what's up? Oh, thank you. You see, I wanted to ask you about location. Hey, Cody changed. So cute. Uh, for a store we were thinking about opening. Perfect. Thanks to you, we've gained a lot of customers on this island who can't wait for me to uh, to come here peddling. Uh, so I've been talking with my sister about opening a proper store right here on this island. So today I came to chat with Tom Nook and we had a great conversation. He was like, we have some materials left over from building Nook's Cranny, hmm? All that must be done is to select an appropriate location, yes? Oh, and the perfect sorry, and the perfect individual to help you find that location would be Nicole, yes, hmm, yes. <laughs> I would love to see like if she said that in Tom Nook's voice, I think that would be so funny. So I figured I'd just keep doing the tra uh, traveling peddler thing until I ran into you again, and that's now. Oh geez, I just keep rambling on, haven't I? Sorry, I'm pretty excited about all this. No, I'm excited too. <laughs> Anyway, my sister and I uh, would feel better opening the shop with the help of someone Tom Nook trusts. So how about it, Nicole? Can you be our location scout? Sure thing. Seriously? Oh, you're a total lifesaver. All right then, let me give you... <gasps> is today Sunday? <laughs> Wait, so much is happening. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Um, all right then, let me give you this Taylor's construction kit. <laughs> So much is happening. Oh, just set it up uh, whatever spot makes sense to you. And that's where, hi Cody, good morning. Cody's like, did you say hi to me today? Not yet, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that's where we'll have our shop built. <laughs> I have to interrupt him, I'm sorry. Hey, uh, Gra Gra, you good? What's the latest? Don't forget to cool down after workout. You don't want to overheat. Thank you, Cody. I feel like he's always worrying about me. Let me ask him what's up one more time. Apparently, Moringa's feeling pretty crummy. I'm sure she'd feel better if you paid her a visit. Oh, thank you, Cody. Wait, so uh, I haven't even opened the gifts. Let me do that really quick. Um, oh, an HHA pennant? Oh, <laughs> I'm assuming it's a wall item, sorry. And, uh... A Nook Miles ticket, nice, okay. And then we have the Taylor's construction kit. So should we go see Meringue? Should we go visit this first? Should we place the, I'm like overwhelmed, there's so much to choose. Okay, uh, let's look at the map really quick. This is what our map looks like right now. Wow, our island has grown so much. I think I'm gonna keep the shops near like Guanamana Airport and Town Hall. I think eventually I'll move the museum someplace else. Maybe by the beach would be kind of cute or near my place because eventually I want to move where I live also. Oh, also, I have a friend, actually a few of you, but also like close friends of mine taught me what this one in fish is so I can teach you that later. Hey, look, and we have a peach tree. Yay. I planted this with my friend Danielle. Yay, she helped me. Um, oh, and we have Daisy and me. Hello there, I'm Daisy May. Oh my goodness. Do you know my Gram Gram Joan? She knows, she seems to know an awful lot of folks. So I always ask. Anyway, she said I'm old enough now to help out with the family business, so here I am. Oh, I forgot to tell you what the family business is. It's selling turnips. Have you heard of So Joan's Stock Market? Well, I'll be here every Sunday morning with a fresh crop of turnips, so come say hi anytime. Oh, Huey Daisy May, you forgot the sales pitch. Gram Gram's totally <laughs> told me enough times. I ought to remember how this goes by now. So, do you want to hear about the So Jones stock market works? Yes, please. Um, okay, you can do this. Oh, she's so cute. 
So turnips are a cute little root vegetable that are good for pickling and stewing. Graham Graham always says that the stock market turnips are for selling, not eating. I always forget. Anyway, if you time things right, they can be mighty nutritious for your bank account. That's so cute. Uh, should I keep going with the explanation? I think I'm good. <laughs> I don't blame you. Graham Graham is always talking folks ears off about turnips. So right now, turnips are going for 100 bells. Do you want to buy some? Uh, you know, actually, I've never been that uh, like involved in the turnip stock market, but I think I'll try because Daisy Mae's so cute. So how can I say no to her? Great, how many should I put you down for? They're 100 bells each and they sell in bundles of 10. All right, so 10 turnips comes to 1,000 bells. Does that sound okay to you? Yeah, I'll buy them. <laughs> okay, come again. Cute. She's so cute. I love her. Turnips, turnips, watch them rise. Try and earn a nice surprise. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh my gosh, Daisy Ray, I love you so much. Okay, actually, uh, an additional thing I did yesterday was kind of think about where I eventually want to put some paths. And I kind of marked them with flowers and cleared the tree. Oh yeah, look, see, I cleared that tree. That was always like hiding me when I uh, left the house. So maybe I can actually put Abel next to me. Would this be, oh hi Rex, cute. So I'm thinking when we leave Guanabana Airport, I want to have like a, a three-way path and then we can choose to go left, up, or right. That's what I'm thinking. I'm going to move this and then put build here. Should I reserve this space? Let me imagine it. This will be cute, right? Next to the beach. Okay. I feel bad for Cody, he's surrounded by everyone. But I know eventually I wanna move Cody to the like higher tiers. So this is where the tailor shop will go. A new wave of fashion will wash over us. That's so cute. Yay, I'm so happy about this. So I wonder if that means tomorrow it'll be finished. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> Okay, I'm assuming we need to tell her. Hey, you found a spot for the shop. Thanks so much, Nicole. Once we, uh, once we're all set up and everything, I hope you'll swing by and support my sister and me. Yay! I actually want to see what she has today too. Oh, hey, Nicole, what's up? What's on sale? <laughs> you got it. Here's what I'm selling today. Oh. Wait. These are cute. For corduroy pants, I'll buy. <laughs> oh, I got a really cute skirt yesterday from a balloon. It was a lemon skirt, but I don't have like a shirt that will look cute with it. But actually, this is kind of cute. I don't think it'll match that lemon skirt I found in the balloon yesterday, but it's still really cute. I might just get it. Maybe I can use it in a different season. Yeah, you got it. Thank you, Mabel. Oh, I'm so excited for you to move here. <laughs> Thanks. Do you want to look at anything else? No, thanks. Thank you. See you next time. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Let's go see. Oh, we need to see Marin. I feel bad, like, having so much fun if she's not feeling well. So how about I can show you my expanded home and also get some medicine to give Marin. Yay, so this is my newly expanded home. It's just a little bigger. Oh, this was the little washer that the HHA gave me for expanding. But I also included this little panda that we bought a few days ago. I completely forgot to include it. But yeah, she's here next to my bed now, which is very nice. Um, I moved the posters a little bit in hopes that eventually I will get some more. And I think that's really it. But yeah, I'm gonna move H. Ah, yeah, let's see what this is. Oh, that worked. I'm assuming it's a, yeah, hang on wall. It's pretty, but like, I don't want it. Oh no, no, I don't want this. <laughs> I want the mirror. I'm just gonna put it in storage right now because I do like it, it just doesn't fit with what I have. Uh, shell, <gasps> hey, I found enough sand dollars to the shell table. Oh my goodness, so we can put that outside today. Actually, I can show you right now. Look, it's so pretty, isn't it? Actually, I may keep it for myself. It's so cute. Hmm, should I keep it? I can make another one to put outside. Initially, I wanted to put this outside, but it's really cute and I want to keep I'm going to just leave it there. I'll just pretend that it was originally for me. <laughs> oh, and let's get the 
medicine for meringue i have a few bags because actually yesterday oh my goodness yesterday i got stung by wasp too oh, yesterday wasn't fun <laughs> Okay, so I grabbed a bag of medicine, so let's go see Meringue and hope that she can feel better with it. Oh, I feel bad that she's sick. Oh my gosh, I love Guaravana so much. Oh, she looks so cute, but she's sick. That's so sad. Oh, let's go. Oh, oh. <laughs> Hachu, are you here to check up on me? Did you just sneeze on my face? That's not really hygienic. I'm sorry, Meringue. I got some medicine. Oh, they... Here you go. Who? One worry off my mind. Thanks to you, I feel like I'm already starting to recover from that cold. You helped me out. So in return, I'd like to thank you by giving you a rainbow sweater. That's so nice. I'm really grateful. Oh, Meringue, feel better. That medicine you brought me is really working, Nicole. I feel like I might end up with more energy than I had before I got sick. Oh, that's good. I'm glad it worked. Feel better. You look cute in your pajamas, though, I have to say. Oh, <laughs> she gave us a little rainbow sweater. I want to see what that looks like. Oh, it's cute. It's so cute. Oh, I may have to change what I'm wearing today. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, now finally that we've helped out a little bit about... Oh my god, bless you. <laughs> so cute. Now that we've helped out around Guanawana, I think it's time to finally meet. Uh, or I guess be reintroduced to Isabel and see the new resident services. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, I love the music in here. I remember hearing this for the first time. I think it was the Animal Crossing direct and I was like, this is my favorite. Ah, Nicole, hello, hello. Welcome to the new and, uh, sorry, new and improved resident services tent. Oh, did I say tent? Of course I meant building and we couldn't have built it without your help. Now, as I mentioned in my broadcast, we have new support staff for the building. So Isabel's here to take good care of us. You're Nicole, right? Mr. Nook has told me about you. I just started today, so I'm sure I'll have my hands full learning about all the ins and outs of this new job. But I'm already smitten with island life, so you can count on me to give my absolute best. She's so cute. And there you have it. Isabel and I will split up duties here to better support you all. Broadly speaking, I'll take care of anything related to homes or other construction issues. Isabel will help you with general island matters and resident support. Sit on the appropriate counter when you need help and will rush over in the swish of a raccoon's tail. In fact, have a seat now and we can introduce you to some new services. Now with that out of the way, I have something I'd like your help with. When you have a moment, please sit at my counter. I hope I can count on you and your continued support of Guanabana and their new resident services building <laughs> so cute I love the music oh we're not at that part of the song <laughs> it's so pretty in here let's talk to Isabel first because I think I'm gonna get distracted by what Tom Nook says <laughs> oh Nicole here you are already. At this counter, I can help you with both general issues and issues you may face with other residents. We can delve into details when specific concerns arise. No need to worry about that right now. But since you're here, I may as well ask, do you have any specific concerns at the moment? Um, I think I'm good. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with Guanabana right now. All right, then if there's anything I can assist you with in the future, please don't hesitate to ask. Oh, she's so cute. I'm so happy to have her. Okay. Well, hello there, Nicole. Your home is much roomier, yes? Ah, I forgot about that. Oh, no. <laughs> it's nice to have even a little extra space, which brings us to the cost of your remodel. It'll be 198,000 bells, hmm? Ah, yes. Please make your payments at Nookstop's ABD feature as you've done before. As, uh, as always, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Yes, yes. You got me good, Tom Nook. <laughs> Yes, yes, this is a construction consultation. Uh, sorry, yes, yes, this is, this is, oh my goodness, this is the construction consultation counter. Before we begin, allow me to quickly explain the services offered at my count counter. In addition to my normal duties, I can also talk about issues related to island construction. There are lots of fun little projects that we, that will make the island a more comfortable place to live. 
I can help with building bridges and inclines such as ramps and stairs or even moving existing buildings. These are options. These are <laughs> sorry. I'm just so like happy. Uh, these are optional extras for your island experience. So these services will of course incur additional fees. Um, and with all the information of mine, what do you think? How can I be of assistance to you? Uh, uh, you wanted my help? Oh, you're already eager to hear how you can help out, hmm? Well, we've got a fine building of resident services now, and you've no doubt admired the plaza, hmm? It's primed and ready for major events if I have anything to say about it. To think about, to think that we started with a deserted island and have grown into a bustling community. I wanted to do something grand to celebrate. Oh yes, I have big plans. <laughs> me too, Tom. Uh, tell me more. Oh, 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 got your attention, hmm? Our goal? It's to have an incredible, ah, incredibly popular musician KK Slider come and put on a show here in Guanabara. He is so cute. <laughs> Nicole, I'm sure you know who KK is. Yes, I'm his biggest fan. <laughs> I always knew you had excellent taste, Nicole. By the way, his song KK Lament is my go-to karaoke song. I want to see Tom Nook sing karaoke. That is so cute. Uh, sorry about that. As you might guess, I'm a big fan. It's easy to get sidetracked talking about him. <laughs> Back to our goal. If we hold a KK concert here, Guanabara could become a household name. We've done a lot so far to further the development of this island, but a KK show would be a culmination of all our hard work. I'd love your cooperation, Nicole. When you're ready for more details, come ask what should I do again? Okay. <laughs> Uh, this is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you? Um, ooh, let's hold the ceremony first and then I'll ask what should I do because I will definitely <laughs> get distracted if I start like asking too many questions. Oh, you want to take part in the ceremony, Nicole? Right now we're looking into holding a ceremony for the resident services building. Interested? I sure am. Oh, I hope Meringue can come. Splendid. Let's get started. Oh, I hope Meringue's there. Yay! Okay, good. I'm so happy. Now then, welcome to our dedication ceremony honoring Gonawana's brand new resident services. <laughs> Thanks to everyone's tireless efforts, Gonawana is developing wonderfully. Yes, yes. I must confess, I thought our little resident services building might be a tent forever. But now here we are with a beautiful new facility the whole island can enjoy. Once again, I must thank everyone who supported our efforts. And I would be at fault if I failed to acknowledge the strong ally who helped me run things from now on. Isabel, if you could grace our island friends with a few words. I'm so glad for this opportunity to say thanks to Guanabana. Like Tom Nook said, I'm Isabel. I haven't been on an island long, so I have many ways to go. I have... Ah, sorry. I haven't been on the island long, so I have a ways to go until I'm fully up to speed, but you can count on my bottom bell, <laughs> bell help in any way I can. If you help, uh, if you need anything, come see me. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Isabel. Next, we'll have a few words from someone who made our new resident services building possible. That's right. Let's hear from our rep, uh, resident rep, Nicole. Anything to add? What can I say? We're amazing, good for us. Woo! <laughs> yes, yes indeed. Thank you for your heartfelt and encouraging sentiments there, Nicole. Also, I have to add, I love the music for the ceremonies too. It's so, like, heartfelt. It feels very, yeah, like it's lovely. <laughs> Everyone, please get ready to join me in bringing the ceremony to a close. Also, those wishing to take a commemorative photo should get ready to plus the square circle button. Yes, well then. With hope for our continued growth and to celebrate Guanabana's beautiful resident services. Hooray! Oh, so cute! <laughs> Thank you all. This concludes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. Oh, so nice. Okay, now let's go see what Tom Nook wants to do with Guanabana. I love the music in here. I could sit in here all day. Look what they're doing. Tom Nook's dusting and Isabel's preparing tea or coffee maybe? Let's go see. <laughs> ah, Nicole, hello, hello. This is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you, hmm? Uh, what should I do? 
Ah, I take it means you're ready to hear the details for my plan to draw KK here to hold a concert. I call it Project K. This plan of mine is divided into three main stages. First, we need more visitors to come to our island. Next, we need more folks to move here. And finally, we work hard to increase the overall image of this island. We'll increase the number of tourists and residents and we'll create a Guanabana so loved. Word of how great this island is will reach KK and he'll accept our offer to host a concert here. <laughs> so for the first step, we'll increase the number of tourists by adding a campsite to our island. A campsite will make it easier for visitors to experience life here and it'll make for great PR material too. With that in mind, could you get out your phone, Nicole? Ooh. Ah, and done. I've given you a recipe for a campsite construction kit. Ooh, okay. I want you to craft that and pick a few great spots on the island for our new campsite. Oh, a few. Pick a great spot for an island for our new campsite. I'm counting on you. Ooh, okay, we definitely have to do that today. Let me see if there's anything else I can ask him. Uh, how can I help? Uh, oh, let's talk about infrastructure. Okay, let's chat. There are a number of things we can discuss, but what do you have in mind? Ooh, I want layout changes or I want to add bridges and inclines. Ooh. Oh, curious about bridges and inclines, yes, because with the renovation of resident services, we have something new for getaway package participants. This new service makes it easier to, and fun to add major projects such as bridges and inclines to the island. Major projects don't come cheaply though, no, no. <laughs> However, everyone who lives on the island can freely contribute towards the construction fees. We can discuss your island hopes and dreams even if you don't have the funds together yet. Be advised, you can only have either a bridge or an incline under construction at any given time. So please consider carefully before discussing them with me, hmm? Now, what would you like to discuss? Uh, I just, I want to see the different kind of inclines we can craft. Ooh, curious about setting up an incline? Ramps and stairs make it easier to ascend our cliffs. Yes, yes. Go ahead and pick out from our catalog, please. Ooh, I like them. Oh, okay. Wait, I like this, but I wish there was a white. And I, ooh, I like that. And I also like this, but I wish it was stairs. Well, they're expensive. I didn't even look at the prices. I was just looking at how pretty they are. Okay, this one's not bad. This is pretty too. I like how it's natural. It is called natural. I was gonna say how natural it is. <laughs> cool, okay, so we can do that too. Ooh, there's so much I wanna do today. Hmm, let's do the campsite construction kit first and then we can see uh, how much time we have left. <laughs> Oh, um, my, my, change your mind. It's a rather large project after all. It's a good idea to think it through. Ooh, also, is there anything else? I'm good, thank you. Uh, of course, of course, I'll be here if you need me. I want to check, um, I forgot what it's called. I want to check this. <laughs> Welcome to Nook Stop. There we go, multimedia terminal. Uh, a notice from Nook Mileage Program. We're sorry that the Nook Stop was unable... Oh, sorry. We're sorry that the Nook Stop was unavailable all day yesterday due to the construction of resident services. To make up for that, we're giving any customer who accesses the Nook Stop today 500 miles. Ooh, thank you. Also, regardless of your access history, your daily access bonus will be set to seven plus days tomorrow. Oh, perfect. Uh, we hope to continue to you. We hope you'll continue to use this Nook Stop and the Nook Mileage Program in the future. Thank you. Please select from the following services. I think they said we have new Nook Mile Plus recipes what's a bell voucher Ooh, this is new Ooh, all of these are new Ooh, i want that Ooh, ooh i want that i think that'll be good for the little like festival pond i want to make oh that's super cute oh my goodness wow Ooh, a drink machine <laughs> wow Ooh, cotton candy <laughs> Wow, ooh, a yellow lighthouse, that's cute. <gasps> Teacup. Wait, I want so many of these things. Mm, yeah, destination signpost, redeem. Your DIY recipe has been issued. And in addition, I want to get the lighthouse. Yes, redeem. Perfect. Okay, good, I'm good. Thank you for your patronage. No, thank you. Okay, bye. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So let's go see what we need to craft that campsite construction kit. I think that's what we should definitely do next. Should I craft something? Let's craft. Uh, ooh. Oh, it's a, oh, oh, we can do this. This is easy. <laughs> 
Perfect. I did get some new recipes yesterday. I'm gonna think off the top of my head. Uh, ooh, this is new. Um, ooh, also, Celeste visited me not last night, but the night before last. And um, I was able to gather star fragments, but not enough to make the star wand. But I did want to let you know that I am able to craft this. Ooh, also, Cody taught me how to craft a kettlebell. And so, of course, I crafted one and gave it to him. So he has that in his little fitness garden now, which is really cute. And I think that's it for new recipes. But this is the one I definitely want to work on next. So let's see if I actually have enough crafting material in my storage. Ah, uh, yeah, the destination signpost. We can make this too. Huh? Okay, sweet. I learned the DIY recipe. Perfect. Uh, and let's check our storage. We needed the hardwood. We needed one softwood, I think. And we needed... Okay, so we may need to go collect some wood with the axe. And we definitely have enough iron nuggets. I think we just need to collect enough uh, wood and we'll be good to go. Ooh, rainbow sweater. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's, uh, let's change. <laughs> yeah, should I change? Get changed. Let's see. Ooh, oh, this is the new lemon skirt that I got from a balloon yesterday. It's so cute, but I don't really have any tops that will match it, which is so sad, but yeah. Yeah, I don't think that matches, but that kind of matches actually. Ooh, actually, wait, I still haven't worn my bandana. Okay, no, that's too much. <laughs> Okay, wait, I actually kind of like this. This is so cute. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I don't think we've seen Sylvia or Pinky today. Oh. I guess that was my flimsy axe. Okay. Hi, Cody. Oh, he changed. He isn't in his little fitness jacket anymore. That's so cute. Uh, I need to make a new axe. <laughs> Uh, let's craft. Ooh, we can make this too. I need to make this first though. I made a flimsy axe. Keep crafting. I really like the stone axe actually because I can craft enough or I can use it enough that I can get the maximum amount of wood, but it doesn't actually uh, affect the tree, which is nice. Um, all done for now. Ooh, Sylvia's home. I can go say hi to her too. Oops. Let's go say hi to Sylvia really quick. Hey, she's crafting again. Oh, Sylvia, you're such a hard worker. Sweet, this is really coming along. What you doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Check it out. I'm making a hyacinth lamp. Sylvia, I love you. This DIY takes some major elbow grease, so I like to get all in one on, on it. I feel like she says the same thing every time and I still cannot read it. <laughs> It's so worth the effort though. So you want to give it a whirl? I can show you if you want. Definitely, let's do this. Thought you'd say that. All right, here's the recipes. Go study up. Thank you, Sylvia. I can't wait to see how yours comes out. Okay, perfect, Sylvia. Let's learn this right now. Uh-huh, okay, sweet. I learned a DIY recipe. This will be so perfect for nighttime on Guadalajara because it'll be like cute little flowers and then they'll be lamps. <laughs> Oh, it's so cute. Purple? I don't have purple. I can't even get pink. <laughs> okay, I may not be able to make this today, but one day I will make this. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad we said hi to her. We need to go see Pinky too, actually. Oh, not again, not again, not again, not again. Maybe I can catch it, maybe I can catch it. Maybe, uh, I can't catch it, I was too slow. Ow, oh, I got stung by wasp, I'm so sorry. Um, well, we can get some medicine too. I think I have extra. <laughs> Ooh, also, here's Cody's kettlebell. Thanks for teaching me, Cody. Um, let's see. Yes, okay, we have enough. Let's go craft that campsite construction kit now. Ooh, I wonder where we can put it. I don't even know. So, something to craft? <laughs> Should I craft something? What? Um, where is it? Yes, let's craft this. Craft it. Let's do it. I made a campsite construction kit. All done for now. So I'll show you where I originally wanted to place the campsite. So just around here, I wanted to place the campsite um, because eventually I want to have the cute little Guanabana pond up on the higher tier and then have like a waterfall to kind of circle around so that this little 
uh, like a pond and oh my god Pinky's outside I can see her little booty <laughs> so cute but yeah this would be a cute place but also a house would be really nice here or maybe the Able sisters would have been really nice here uh whoops <laughs> but another place I'm thinking for a campsite now um Ooh, up here would be really cute actually, but I don't think there's enough space right now to place a campsite. I want it to be close because I'm thinking, right, if you visit Guadalajara, you want to be close enough to resident services, so if you have an issue, you can go visit them, but you also have your own secluded place to really experience island life on Guadalajara, like I, like, right? So maybe this would be actually pretty cute. Let me see. Yeah, this actually would be really cute. Oh wait, yeah, I want this to be the campsite. Let's see what it looks like if I place the campsite construction kit here. This is perfect, yes. Okay, let me imagine it anyway. Yes, okay, I love it. Is this a good spot? Okay. Yay! Oh, I forgot I have the wasp thing. <laughs> I picked a spot for the campsite. I hope lots of folks come by to visit. Ooh, I wonder, does that mean tomorrow we may get a campsite? Visitor, the camp, camp, the camper. <laughs> Ooh, let's go see. Timmy and Tommy too. <laughs> oh, daily donation. Oh my goodness. Hi. I feel like this garden hose would be nice for Sylvia for her little garden. But I think I'm gonna pass on everything. Ooh, let me actually check. I, I might as well just buy some medicine. It's okay. I can do that. Let me just buy some medicine. Yeah, I'll just buy one. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I like some of this stuff. Pink stripe paper. Pink stripe wall. Yes. Excellent purchase. Anything else? I also like the yellow floral flooring. I'll buy. And this is actually kind of cool. This cool paint flooring. I'll buy. <laughs> Ooh, I'm going a little crazy today. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Oh, cute. Okay. <laughs> uh, thank you. Nice. Look, I dug up a fossil. Actually, I donated three, uh, I have like a pinky. I donated three different species yesterday. I donated the tarantula. Oh my goodness, I don't know how I caught that. Um, and I also donated the man-faced stink beetle and the emperor butterfly because I just had a lot of fun playing uh, the night when Celeste visited. So I can show you the tarantula, um, but maybe I won't donate anything today because I think that tarantula is enough. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh, here, look, here's the emperor butterfly. So beautiful. Uh, let me go up here. I don't know where the man faced stink bug is, but I know the tarantula's back here because I had to check. I had to see where it was hiding <laughs> so I could avoid it. Oh, he's hiding now. He's the one hiding. <laughs> Actually, I kind of like the lighting right now. Oh, did I learn a reaction yesterday? Please tell me this was the day before. Yeah, I think Cody taught me this uh, shocked reaction yesterday, which was really cute. Oh yeah, so much happened. That's okay, <laughs> because I think today was so much fun too. Oh my goodness, I think today's even better than yesterday, so that's the best, the best feeling. Okay, so let's finally talk to Tom Nook um, and see if there's anything else we can do on Guanabana. Ah, Nicole, hello, hello. Have you found a good location for our campsite? Of course. Splendid. I can't wait to see the spot you picked out. Now that the location is settled, I can proceed with construction. Tomorrow we'll have wonderful campsite for visitors. How exciting. Yay, okay, good. I love this music. Ooh, okay, I think that's actually everything I wanted to do today. I'm so happy. We actually did more than I could even imagine. We're gonna have the Able Sisters tomorrow. We're gonna have a campsite tomorrow. We have Isabel and a new resident services building today, which is so exciting. And I absolutely love this music so much. I'm gonna stay in here for the rest of the day. <laughs> I'm really happy that <laughs> we had so much fun today. Oh, we met Daisy Mae too. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for playing with me on Guanabana today. If you enjoyed, you're more than welcome to subscribe. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you when I see ya. <laughs>